Welcome to Mock Rockets. Legos rock. And so do rockets. Okay, welcome back everyone. And today I'm going to describe for you our mock of SpaceX's Starship uh, prototype named Starhopper. Now the construction began on the real Starhopper in December of 18 and it ended in about February or March of 2019. The first test flight was sort of a tethered one meter hop in April of 2019 and that led up to a series of other uh, flight tests including the amazing 150 meter hop in August of 2019. Now that was almost one year ago. So let me give you a rundown on some of the key specs of the Starhopper. So its diameter is 9 meters wide, which is the same diameter as planned for the real Starship, but the thickness of the steel is a half inch thick. That's 12.5 millimeters. That's super thick and super heavy, and the real Starship will have much thinner steel that forms the uh, tanks and the bulkheads and so forth. Now, our mock here is 367 pieces and I would say one of the main challenges of this is getting the nice round uh, diameter of what works out to be about 10.5 studs and getting that in this sort of six uh, component configuration so that there can be three fins and then three panel sections. And this is the same problem we encountered when we built our uh, 2018 SpaceX BFR a couple years ago and uh, so we used the same technique basically in, in that one. And the fins were a fun, easy build that we just used bricks and slopes and inverted slopes. And we have one engine on the bottom, which is one of these nice Fez hat pieces, which work out to be about the right size. And for the top, we have this nice uh, 10 stud diameter uh, inverted dish piece. And it doesn't have quite the right curvature if you compare it side by side to the photos of Starhopper, but we tried a lot of other things and they didn't quite work as well. Now, what's really fun is to compare it side by side to the Saturn V. And you can see uh, here that it's about the, the same diameter as the main section. Uh, but what I found interesting is comparing it to uh, the S4B booster, which is at the top of the Saturn V. You can see that Starhopper, even though it seems small to us, is actually enormous compared to the S4B booster. Um, it's about the same height as the S4B, it's actually a little taller, um, but much, much wider uh, if we're looking at the diameter of it. Okay, so this, is, this was a fun little mock to build, um, and we would appreciate it if you checked out our website, mockrockets.com. Uh, you can follow us on Twitter, at mockrockets, uh, or you can check out our designs and instructions that are available on rebrickable.com. Thanks, and have a great day.